Hi everyone, it's James in Japan. It is August 27th, 2020, Reiwa 2. You're looking at fish, sanma. Sanma is mackerel. And uh, these are discounted for 298 yen plus tax. And they're due today. So that's what I'm making. And I'm going to show you how to make it. It's really easy. So if you live in Japan, you'll be equipped with this kind of stove. It's a stove with a built-in grill, like this, sorry, it's dirty. Okay, and you have the grill. You need to put water in the pan. So you lift this up. It usually tells you on the tray that you need some water. Mizu o ireru. Okay, so put water in the tray, okay? And what I like to do is spray this with oil. It's up to you. You don't need to, but it's better. So I'm going to close this for a moment. Sorry about this. To switch it on, this is off and this is on. Like that. That turns it on. You see that red light? That means this is activated. So just press this button and another compartment opens up. This allows you to heat up the grill here. So you have fish. This one cooks fish. So if I press this, if I press this button, it automatically turns on. Okay, and it's heating up. So be careful of the level. Right now it's on high, seal. You have yoai and chu, and that is weak, and that is middle, medium. Leave it on medium for now. And you have a timer, and you have automatic mode, it's up to you. Okay, or just press this button to turn it off. Okay. okay, it's really easy. You don't need to season this. I was told that Japanese people don't put salt and pepper on this kind of fish. They use a sauce called pons. I'll show it to you in a moment. This is pons. It looks like a lemon, but it's not a lemon. It's a kind of fruit. And it's like soy sauce, but it gives it a little vinegary taste. You put this over the grilled samma, and it really tastes good. It's really healthy. Some Japanese restaurants grate daikon, which is radish, and it accompanies sama. Let's get started. Each of these sama fish are wrapped in saran wrap. And they come in five. So, giving you security. Oh yeah, ooh, it's getting hot. Yes, it's getting hot. Now I'm going to spray some oil on it. Some olive oil. That's it. Hey fishy fishies. Who's first? Okay, you. I've already washed my hands. It'll take a few minutes to cook on one side. In you go. And then I'm going to turn down the heat. It's on medium. It's been sliced in half. A very clean cut. And it is very small, but very healthy. Japanese people like to eat this kind of fish for breakfast and for dinner or anytime. So, I hope you like Sama. It's been about two minutes. Let's take a quick look at the fish. And the tails are curling up. It's browning. I think it's time to turn them over. Yes. It's really easy. See? Because of the oil. Oh yes, yes. Put the other side. Oh, smells good. If you like fish, then you'll enjoy this. Live longer. Go back in there. I'm beginning to hear something, so I'm going to check on them. Oh, yes, they're done. That was quick. 
Yeah, because they're nice and thin. Mm hmm You can tell they're the fish meat is flaky. And if you're not sure, you can just sample it. I'm gonna sample mine. Oh yes, definitely done, definitely. Look at that. Mmm, mmm, definitely. Okay, I'll take these out. Okay, time for the next batch. Oops, don't get away from me. Two, I've got two more here. Won't fit. Three. If you have a nice dish like this, then use it. It looks cool. That. And then the ponds. And the ponds. Here it is. Just put a little. Just like that. Nice. You can eat this with rice or by itself. It's up to you. But I'm going to eat it with rice. I still have to make rice. And I'm going to sample it. Wow, that is so good. Mm -mm. This ponds is already, it's already salty and vinegary, so it makes the fish taste Wonderful. And that's how to cook this up. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe to my channel. Bye.